Trump News, Donald Trump's connection to Vladimir Putin criticized by Stephen King, Stephen King, in his criticism of Trump, has referred to Trump as running dog for Vladimir Putin. On Monday, he made the remark, Darely hours after Trump addressed Friday's announcement of the death of Alexei Navalny, the imprisoned opposition leader and the Russian president's harshest critic to GOP contender for the 2020 for presidential nomination, Trump was mute over the weekend while leaders worldwide mourn Navalny. Nikki Haley, a Republican running for president, was among his detractors who criticized him for being silent. When Trump did speak out online, it seemed more about him than Putin. He said that Navalny's death has made me more and more aware of crooked, radical left politicians, prosecutors, and judges leading us down a path to destruction in the U.S. Rather than blasting Putin. Soon after, King posted to X formerly Twitter and said, Trump is Putin's running dog. The tweet has since gone viral, with over 1.8 million views. On Tuesday, Newsweek sent an email seeking reaction from representatives of both King and Trump. In response to the horror writer's message, ex-users had mixed feelings. The only exception is that Putin supported Biden. What is it like to know that you are Putin's Russian asset? One person wrote, you are what you preach. This was in reference to Putin's previous statements to reporters, in which he said that he would prefer Biden to Trump in the November election because he is more experienced. Another person countered by saying that Stephen King, a writer, doesn't understand what ownership is, I can't believe you're so worried that Trump will win. A third person said, it's so cute to see you weep. Fiction. A fourth user chimed in, what you do best, this assertion is true, as I can confirm, a user on X remarked. These are the facts, next to a manipulated image of Putin guiding the miniature Trump around on the leash. I've seen every one of your films, and this is the most terrifying thing I've ever seen. It baffles me that any American could back this guy. I appreciate you speaking out. At Steve Enking, someone else replied, mentioning Trump the person. A different ex-user shouted, King is king. Also, another individual said, Trump is a shame. Nearly immediately following Friday's announcement of Navalny's death, Putin came under fire from Russia's Federal Penitentiary Service. According to a statement from the prison service, he was inmates at an Arctic correctional colony when he became ill after a stroll, lost consciousness almost immediately, and passed away not long after. Since his incarceration in February 2021 on accusations of fraud and contempt of court, Navalny had been serving a 19-year term since he was Putin's chief critic. Many believe his accusations are politically motivated in a Monday post on Truth Social. Trump expressed his growing awareness of the situation in our country due to the tragic death of Alexei Navalny. Slowly but surely, we are being led to our doom by crooked, radical left politicians, prosecutors, and judges, open borders, flawed elections, and incredibly unfair court decisions are wreaking havoc on America. We have fallen as a nation, and we will never recover. Megacon 2024. When it comes to Trump and his alleged ties to Russia, King is no stranger. Everyone is aware of Trump's connections to Putin and Russia. According to King's 5.3 million view X post from February 11th, Trump is essentially betraying the American way of life for which our heroes have died. The day before. During a rally in South Carolina, Trump had threatened to urge Russia to attack NATO member states that had not met their financial obligations to the alliance, according to the guidelines.